today a new adventure. We are, what is this place called? Jules something. Look up the name real quick. What's going on? We back at it on another adventure. Jewel Meadows. Jewel Meadows. We're out here looking at elk today for our class. We're gonna try to hit two different spots today. We're gonna be looking at elk and we're also gonna be looking at sea lions, Vince? Yeah, we're gonna see sea lions next. We're out here. I think this place is pretty close to seaside, I think. We were driving for a pretty long time. An hour and a half, and then maybe like two hours to the next spot, maybe three. Hopefully we'll find something to eat soon. Uh, I kind of like woke up and we're like, alright, let's go. Everybody took a shower and we're just like, let's get the fuck out. And now we're here, chilling. We actually, oh, look at him, so cool. So cute. Um, actually, over there. Here, let's adventure. Dum, 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 dum. All right, so over there. I don't know, let's see if I can. Dun, 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 dun. These guys. These freaking guys over here. Look, these are all these elk. There's so many of them. Bro, what are y'all even doing? They're just lounging, not even feeding or anything. They just hanging. They look pretty big. These two dudes over here are like, Enthusiasts. They're like, oh, the elk looks so much bigger today. I'm like, bro, how do they get any bigger from one day to the next, you know? I wish I knew those secrets. All right, nothing too exciting out of here. We're headed to the next spot pretty soon. Uh, did you look it up? Yeah. All right, we're moving. What's the next place called? Um, Astoria. Astoria. At the edge of Washington. That's our cue to go. So here we are in Astoria looking for sea lions and sea what? Seals. Seals. Um, what are the, what's the difference of them? I have no idea. But uh, at the first dock, didn't really see anything. We're gonna head to some of the other places, but also trying to find something to eat. We're on the road all day, and I'm hungry. Careful, you might get wet. Yeah, I noticed. Pretty lackluster. Yeah, it was like a really big boy <laughs> Boarding pass. We're going to the museum, but first they were like, check out this ship, the Columbia. Ah, oh, there she is. I was wondering why the ship was just out of here. I guess we're gonna uh, hop on board and check it out. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. Come on in. <laughs> Woo! Close the door, it's a little warmer in here than it is out there. Where are you guys from? We are from Vancouver, Washington, sir. Welcome to uh, Astoria. Have you been here on the light ship or at the museum before? No, sir. No? No, okay. Well, let me tell you a little bit about it, and I'll tell you this, okay? Cool. A light ship is a lighthouse that floats. Okay? All right. And the reason why they had it, when, when back in 18, late 1800s, they built the North Head Lighthouse and the Cape Disappointment Lighthouse, but they needed a third lighthouse out here. Cool. There wasn't a rock to build one on, so they put a lighthouse on a ship and anchored a ship out there. That was in 1892. And between then and this ship, there were a total of four light ships that were out there. The first one was in 1892. This one served from 1951 to 1979. Oh, wow. In 1979, it was retired and it was replaced by that buoy that you see on the top picture. But yeah. That guy. And then that has since been replaced by a buoy like this, which is a more modern buoy. Oh, cool. Okay. And then uh, when you were walking down the uh, pier, did you notice that big round thing on the front of the ship? Yeah. Sure. Okay, that was the primary anchor. That's this guy right here. That weighs 7,000 pounds. Yikes. And that was attached to the ship with about 12, 11, 1,200 feet of two inch chain. And this was anchored in about 200 feet of water. A ghosty ship. I had a change. Um, 
my camera because my camera died. So now I'm using Vincent's phone. Man, like I was very informative. Super cool. I feel this is spooky. It's almost like a mirror. <laughs> Looks like food. <laughs> oh wait, hey. Yeah. Hold it. Hey. No. Hey, stay here. Probably not allowed down there. Oh, this is pretty spooky. I feel like I'm in a spooky movie. Yeah, I got sick on that day. Yeah. Probably sick. <laughs> it's it's a mirror. This is cool. Although they look like they've like batched down everything, batten down the hatches. I can imagine being like in a place like this. <laughs> All these are like bunkers. Would you ever spend a night on one of these ships? Sure. Yeah, okay. yeah this doesn't look too bad. I'm not chill. You know, like, uh, there are people that make a fuck ton of money just like spending a lot of time on these ships and going fishing or like commercial fishing. Kind of like a. Uh, commercial fishing is dangerous. Yeah, yeah. It makes a lot of money. This place is like this next spot up here is pretty cool. It's like a it's like a lounge. We got homies on the wall. I can't wait till I like, review this like footage later and then see a spooky ghost behind me somewhere. Or in front of me, I guess, since I can't turn the camera around anymore. Ah, oh, finally, some coffee. Pretty sure it was locked. Hey bro, you're not supposed to be on there. Or or you, dude. What are you doing? Bro, bro, that's definitely not sanitary. The heck is going on down here? Oh, captain, my captain. Watch your head. I did something. Oh, that's one part with the bar. Oh, that's a lot of color. Hurts my eyes. What is this? Yo, it's a green screen. It's a, oh, wait. No. It is. <laughs> oh, yeah. Alright, um, conduct, conduct the weather. Uh, as you can see, today is Tuesday, which is 65 degrees. So it's supposed to be raining, even though it's clear skies. And, um, oh, now, now we're <laughs> here. It's coast. Spooky ghost. It's a spooky ghost. It's a spooky. Look at my face. Is it your sunglasses? No, these are my regular glasses. Oh. That's a big thing. I don't know if any of you guys are into boats or not. I really don't know too much about boats, but I can appreciate a cool looking boat. These guys have got the right idea. They've got their seat belts on. Yeah. They're going crazy. Hey, dude, X marks the spot. Am I right? Oh, they're saving somebody. 
I'm pretty sure that's defying gravity. Just go out there and get him, bro. Rough bar. I'm having a rough day. Y'all play video games? Y'all heard of Big Daddy? Here's the Puff Daddy. What's up, homie? Oh, I thought this was a mirror. It's not the. What's going on here? Ah, again, dude, leaving random fish around. Alright, so actually we were able to find the seals and the uh, sea lions. Uh, they were all the way on the pier that we couldn't get to because of uh, construction issues. We couldn't actually go out there and like look at them. So we had to take pictures from really, really far away. Like we could barely see them. But we got to see them and that's why we came out here. So successful in all three animals, I guess. Like seeing the elk and then seeing sea lions and then um, the other one. Deer. Deer. And uh, yeah, super successful day. Super late in the day. It's like 4, 4.30 now, and the sun's coming down. And we gotta drive through windy roads. But we'll make it safe. And thank you for watching. And I'll see you later.